What's up, PlayStation Nation? Mario back here, and uh, today I just want to remind you guys um, that in this video that you're about to see, everything is personal opinions, nothing fact proven, other than the facts that I am searching up. Um, but I try to I try to remind you to take it easy on the guy. It is one of his first videos. Um, so just take it easy on him, <laughs> don't go all technical on him in the comments down below. Give this video a like really quick, it would, I would appreciate it very much. It's really late, so that's why I'm, like, mumbling a lot, and I'm really tired. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop a like down below, comment what you thought, and, uh, remember, everything is personal opinion, so, yeah, just, just, um, <laughs> just, I hope you enjoy it. What's up, PlayStation Nation? Mari back here. Today, I'm with a close friend called Super Size Boy. And today, we're going to be doing uh, a little bit of a podcast uh, and basically summing up all of Call of Duty Ghosts. You want to say anything, Super Size? Um, I want to say thank you for having me here. Yeah, it's, um, it's no hopefully problem. Hopefully, we can do more of these later on. Yeah, yeah. And uh, just letting you know, this might be cut into many pieces, not just one, because it, it, it should be a long video. It should be a long podcast, uh, somewhat, because we've got, we've, got, we've got a lot of shit to talk about. Yeah, same with my channel too. Yeah, so uh, let's start it off with first impressions of Call of Duty Ghosts. What right, are yours? You, you want me to go? Yeah. yeah. All right. I personally yeah. think the game is definitely be it, it's the best Call of Duty they've made in a long time. Um, it kind of ties up with Black Ops Two and Modern Warfare Two. Uh, Black Ops Two was a good game, and so was Modern Warfare Two, but. Call of Duty Ghost has that Modern Warfare 2 feel to it, but it also has that futuristic feel, even though it's not supposed to be futuristic. Yes. It's, it still somewhat feels futuristic, and I like that. I think it adds all more character to it. What do you think of it? Um, To be honest, it's an okay game. It's, um, I'll, I'll play it because who doesn't like to play COD and everything? Yeah. Um, I, to, In my impression, uh, I like Black Ops 2 much, much more. Yeah, you're you're well, a, a like you're, it, you're a Treyarch person. It's understandable. Yeah, yeah, I'm more into like the zombies and things yeah. and stuff. But um, this is pretty fun too. I play daily basis. Um, but uh, I people were complaining about Black Ops Two being too futuristic. But um, this is pretty. To be honest, this pretty futuristic too. Um, I'm surprised for a year it takes place in. Well, what what year does it take place in? I want to know. I'm pretty sure it just takes place in 2013. Am, Are I you think, serious? I could be wrong. I it's, could be wrong. Let but me search that up right now while you talk. Just continue talking. Yeah, it's an okay game. Um, I still molest a lot of people online. <laughs> um, yeah, just some I, I some things about it are a little spiffy to me. Um, just uh, I don't know. It doesn't feel the same. I I like th games with a little more color to it. Not just everything so dull. Um, yeah. It's a little hard to see sometimes too, people, which uh, it's kind of a pain in the ass. <laughs> But um, overall, yeah, I still get my fair share of kills. Um, just uh, some 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 uh, attachments and shit. I'm not really liking. Like I don't like the new way the scopes are and shit. How it's blinds everything out. And um, you're not. You're um, basically not feeling all the new stuff. You're just not used to it. It's it's kind of yeah. I don't like. I like yeah. the old way. Like also with the SATCOM, I don't like the way they have that now. I like the UAV, the old fashioned one. You gotta think of it this way. It's still a new game. I mean, you didn't like any game that came out in the beginning because you're still not used to it. But give it a few months and. Well, yeah, true. I guess. Yeah. yeah. You, you gotta give it a little bit of time. You can't yeah, just. Hopefully keep... they don't mess it up more. But yeah, that's all. It's it's a fine game. I personally, I'm I'm more of a okay because uh. To, to understand this, kids, I have to take you back a little. My first Call of Duty ever was Modern Warfare 2, and that was because that's when I got my PS... Uh, PS3 was 2009. I got it at that time, and Modern Warfare 2 was my first game. So I've always had, like, a little bit more of a connection to, to Infinity Ward than Treyarch. Because everybody knows about that drop from Modern Warfare 2 to Black Ops. It was kind of a disappointment. Um, and I think that's why I, I don't like Treyarch as much as Infinity Ward. Um, I don't feel it as much. MW3 was actually a pretty terrible game, to be honest. Yeah, that was, that was Infinity hard. Ward, I mean, other than, um, that whole survival thing they had going on, I forgot what it was called. The one spec where they... Ops, something about Spec Ops. Yeah, it was Spec Ops, yeah. yeah it was, was okay. It was, it was a good game. I mean, I don't know. It was definitely a letdown. It was more of a letdown than Black Ops. Um, mm. because people expected it to be a big thing, because, you know, Modern Warfare 2, and Modern yeah, Warfare... if MW3 uh, yeah. came right after, and Black Ops came right after MW3, I think that would have been... But I think Black Ops would have been a big hit compar in comparison of Modern Warfare 3. 
Yeah. But because Black Ops came uh, after Monofer 2, it was kind of a letdown for everyone. Yeah, what you mean? Yeah. Um, so Call of Duty Ghosts, that's an okay game. Um, In my opinion, Call of Duty Ghosts is a fantastic game. I think they have too many perks, though. Do they? They I mean, but then many. again, they even it out with the whole thing. If you don't have a lethal and if you don't have like a secondary, the less you have, the more you have of perks. I guess, but also, I like the way Black Ops 2 did, where, like, you didn't have. They gave you a certain amount. Oh, another thing I want to touch up on. I'm sorry. Go on, go on. I'll touch up no, on this after right, yours. Right. All right. Um, it's the whole point thing. The <clears throat> what are they called? The points where you can buy guns and uh. Oh, the squad points. Yeah, squad points. I don't, I don't like, like that. that one bit i don't know why they would add such a thing it defeats the whole purpose of leveling up like why the fuck am i leveling? yeah like yeah you why am i the same prestige why the hell am i leveling up if i i'm not even gonna get shit other than squad points i mean uh, yeah there's no point now, leveling up if now that i say it out loud so now that i say it out loud it kind of makes sense but then again i don't know man <laughs> i don't know it's not it's yeah, not exactly you can literally do <coughs> get squad points so easily by just doing tasks and shit every time you pick up one of those like little briefcases. Little briefcases, yeah. Called. It's not exactly my cup of tea. It's yeah, like because you can be like level ten and, and have, have like so many. Yeah, and have better things. guns than like a freaking level fifty. Yeah, it's, or whatever I like, it goes I up like to. I like the old way, like where you just rank yeah. up, get some guns. And that was the whole point of ranking up. Now I'm like my. I've noticed something like ever since Call of Duty Ghost, I've been like my main idea has been like ratio, 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 ratio. Yeah. It hasn't been like. Prestige, prestige, prestige. Even though I have a series going on, Road to Prestige. My main yeah. goal is like my, to keep my KD up. You know, mm -hmm. it's it's it. I it kind of defeats the purpose of leveling. If you want my honest opinion, I still yeah. I still I don't know. It's not that big of a deal. But then again, it kind of is. You know. Yeah. Yeah. What you mean? Yeah. Is that is that all we have for this topic? Um, I think it, yeah. I is think. it? Yeah. So let's just sum it up. Uh, my first impression of Call of Duty Ghost, fantastic, absolutely amazing. Love the graphics on the PS4. Yeah, yeah, they're they're pretty good looking. Yeah, you. Got the 1080p right there. <laughs> yeah, looks pretty, pretty amazing, nice. damn it. Pretty nice.